going in the shop. First, Doug's here. Gonna, gonna put his door handles on his car. What I've asked him to do, and I'm gonna put it on camera, is not to swipe on the paint. Do not wipe the paint. The only reason I'm saying that is because it's fresh, and we do not want to scratch it, and it will scratch very easily. We just want to put the door handles in and leave the paint for a while, that's all. Don't mean to go in once you get in here before you, probably. Just okay. a second, I'll turn the lights on, baby. Yeah, maybe all the lights. What? Did you No, he's pulled out. That's just some of the dust that was here. Oh. Come on and take a look at it, bud. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> huh? Listen, buddy. That's a show car. <laughs> well, that's what you'll be doing this summer. That's gorgeous. I think it smartened it up, didn't it? Smartened it up. It's gorgeous. Yeah! Wow. That's beautiful. <laughs> yeah, it smartened it up, didn't it? Oh, I guess. Yeah, we smartened it up a bit. We get the door handles and all the chrome back on it. Wow, that looks right. like brand new. In fact, it's probably better than brand new. I, don't I was thinking probably it was a little better. I, but I don't think the line is good. <laughs> That quality of paint jobs. We, we, we laid her on there, bud. That is this, 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 broke, this broke off nice. You know what I mean? The, the tape, the, the yep. paint broke off nice. Yep. Um, oh, it started off very nice. Beautiful. Wow. He made myself happy coming in this morning looking at it. Actually, wow. made myself look happy. That looks like the, the, the deck on the uh, on that one you did for the uh, brewery. Yeah. You know, that, 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 that was. When I looked at that, it was a long deck, and it was it had that that, that look to it. it was it just gorgeous. it's got a nice flat sheen to it, has it not? Absolutely. Yeah, I think so too. Nice and black. That looks like it's been polished for a week. That's weird. That's good. My goodness. Yeah, nice and straight down the sides. That thing just as straight as an arrow, buddy. That's some job. Well, there you go. Let's try to find some door handles. <laughs> you want to touch it? <laughs> we, we pinched right down here too, and I think that was supposed to be. Okay. Well, so that's where the silver and the black stopped. Yeah, yeah. Very neat. So it kind of yeah. uh, does a little bit for it, eh? It does, doesn't it? Yeah. But yeah. that had to be done there, I think. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Yeah. Jolene yeah. picked up on that. Yeah. That's absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful. Awesome. When you get, like you say, you get all your stuff on her, get her aside, it's going to be quite something. Wow. Yeah. I think. I don't think I've ever seen a pen job that nice. Something damn, Doug. You're getting to my heart strength. <laughs> Are you sure? Absolutely. Let, 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 let's just leave it and not touch it. <laughs> he just, are you sure? Yeah, yeah. You just want to leave for a bit? Yeah, let, let it harden properly and, uh, you know, I can, I can mess with that. We can come down when you do it and help. Yes, we can, you know, yeah. if you want to. I'll, I'll, I'll just take my time and, uh, and uh, I suppose we, yeah. See, if you put him on the camera on that stuff, you'll see a lot of smoke coming, won't you? <laughs> yeah. There'll be smoke coming from me. Yeah, it really is something. It's probably not something. I don't know. We can do it, though. Let's put the back ones on. 
The back ones are fairly simple, you know, we can do those. Let's do the back ones. Okay. What the heck? We'll just go slow. We'll just do the back ones. I'm gonna go and bring those bits and pieces. Okay. Back, first of all. Now, where, where are you gonna put that head? Yeah, we want a safe place for We're it. We're doing trading today. <laughs> Doug gets to come look at his car and he's got the head done. It's gotta go on its side, does it not? It should, yeah. So now give me a hand with it, would you? Should we have a place to set it before we get it out? Uh, well, as long as it's on its side somewhere. I don't know what to do with it. In fact, this. you could put a soft, a soft blanket down and, 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 set it, and set it on top of that. Um, okay. I, I, I didn't tighten the, uh, the camshafts down so the valves aren't extended. Yeah, okay. Um, as soon as you tighten those down, that, that, now, now, you, now you got an interference. And I, I'll show you what I mean by that. The, uh, That's an interference the, engine. The, <laughs> and, uh, and I'll show you just how much interference it is. When, when the, uh, if the cams are in the wrong position uh, and you tighten them down, yes. the, the intake valves will hit the exhaust valves. Wow. Yeah. That's just how, how tough they are. So you have to have them in the right uh, in, in the right orientation before you before you crank that down or, or, or put it on the engine. So you, you, you want the engine in, um, with with the number six in top dead center. Okay. Uh, before you before you put the head on. Okay. And and you. Yeah. Can I set that head right there? We'll Absolutely. Sure. Okay. Yep. Yeah. I'm going to move this. Yeah. We're doing some trading. We're doing some trading. Very happy with it, wasn't he? Mm -hmm. Wow. You know, very happy with it. I'm happy with it too, you know. I just wanted it to be perfect for him. And uh you know, it's close. Good, I'm glad he's happy. You know, it does look it does look really good. Mm -hmm. You know, with the black paint job on it, it does look good. Coffee's good this morning, thank you very much, baby. Welcome. It's a good good day here at Hilt's Auto Co. With Doug being happy with it, he don't even want to touch it, put the door handles in it. <laughs> that says something, does it not? Mm -hmm. Do, 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 do. Hi, Tina. Can I carry this myself? I'm a big boy now. <laughs> She's back. <laughs> Can shafts are not torqued down. Is that what you're telling us, Dutch? Yeah, yeah, I'll show you. Look at that now, would you? See, these are. Pull this up. These are just in situ, but they're they're finger yeah finger loose. You've got them wafers in there? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> that, that took me a full day to, to sort the wafers out. You yeah. you, you put them in. Uh, you put thin ones in first of all. Yeah. You 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 you, you crank the, uh, the this down. You measure them, all the gaps. Then then you determine which measure with like gauges. With gauges. Yeah. And then you determine how much, oh, uh, uh, under you are. For, for additional wafers to bring it up to specs. Like that has to be six thou, that has to be four thou. Okay, so when we were like eight and 10, they, they weren't right at all then? No, not right at all, no. Gotcha. So if you were, were to turn- Wow, look at that now, would you? Look at that snapping thing. If you were to turn that around. That looks good. Um, you could have those valves in it. See this, this exhaust? Yeah. If, if this was open, that would come up and jam on gotcha. that. Gotcha. So, so, so you, you can't, uh, Oh, those are all new valves in them. There you go. And new uh, new bearings in the in the camshaft as well. Look at that now, would you? Yeah. So when when you uh, when you put those in situ, there's a mark on the. Uh, see this? Yeah. There's a tool you put on that uh, to 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 uh, to put that in the proper orientation when when you put the timing chain on. E each one has to be on on that. That has to be in in, uh, in uh, top dead center for, for number six, and then you tighten them down. 
We won't get me to do it. No, no. But I'm you're telling. <laughs> I'm just just showing you yep. how critical it is uh, that everything be in place. Yeah. Be before you tighten things down. You, you could be in a big mess even before you start. Exactly. I'm gonna pull this out of your way if we get it. Yeah. I'm painting this thing. That's that's gonna Next. make an engine out of it, and and I've got new pistons for it, and and new rings. Cool. Uh, and new inserts. So we'll get an engine stand. One day we'll have it nice and clean here for a bend yeah, or two, yeah. and we'll flip it over and do it together. And I'll paint that up when 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 we're when we're finished. So we get the carbs done. So we're we're starting to get it together. Starting to get it together. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Valve paint covers look good. You might just want to put a put a piece of shell paint or something over that to keep the dust out. Yes. Okay. So I'm gonna be a piece of plastic, a piece of plastic yeah. right here. Yeah. And I'm just right your way here. Well, we won't mess with that. Yeah. That's for sure. Yeah, that, that uh, by buffing wheel is, isn't as strong as it should be, but no. that, that cleaned up reasonable. Oh, yeah. Clean up. Did, did you uh, do the intake? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you still got that out there? Yeah. yeah. Doug's been working like a, like a beaver. <laughs> you know what I mean? Whew. Beavers, that's all they do when they work. Huh? Make dams. That's all they do is eat. Work. That's what they do. Anyways, you clean them up for me. Going to make a different. We got a different uh, small block Chevy, and uh, we wanted to make it like a '60s era Chevy looking thing. I, I just glass beat it. Wow, that looks nice. Yeah, beautiful. Something right on there if you like. Yeah. There's yeah. an old time. Huh? Beautiful. Kind of dress it up a little bit. Well done. Uh, these, these are just plastic, and they're just pushed in. Okay. I, I was wondering what they were. Yeah, I, uh, I took a little uh, Allen key and twisted that and, and looked at it at the same yeah. time. And then they, they just pushed out. Just for looks. Yeah, just for looks. Just for looks. All right, cool. We're going to try to get a door handle in, Ernie? You say so. <laughs> the door handle, we left them in the car, didn't we? We did. What, uh, what were you worried about uh, opening the hood? Where, where, uh... I have a place right here. Right here. I'm shy. See a little, I'm shy there a little bit. See that? Can you see right there? No. Well, down inside there on that edge, Yes. I'm shy a little. Okay. And when I'm shy, I'll just paint. Yeah. Okay. What I want to do is I want to run a little tape, piece of tape on this side, a little piece of tape on this side, and just blow in a little bit of paint there. Yeah. And, well, yeah. That's what that's what we do. <laughs> you know, I mean, it's a simple it's a simple fix. You really want to blow it in, or you just you just uh, brush it in? Well, uh, I can, I usually spray out of a gun. <laughs> I, I, know, I give up brushing cars. <laughs> Jim get, Jim's got that one. <laughs> no, I just put a little tape, a piece of paper there, right? Yeah. It's a little low low pressure. Pss, 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 and just put a little paint on it. There's a little spot inside the door we want to touch too, but here to there. That's here to there. Yeah. You know what I'm trying to tell you? Yeah. That's here to there. See, I'll get that, try to get that done today, and then tomorrow, it'd be okay. Mm -hmm. If you know what I mean, if we do that today, yeah. come on out the door. This one's a rubber. Get some on top of that. Choose it up on you. Mm -hmm. Anyways. You want that off? No, yeah, we want that off. Um, there's the door handle. Do you remember how that goes? Do you remember all the tools we need? <laughs> we'll let you by here, we'll let you in there and take a look at you, but I'm going to get your light. I want to make sure that it hits. There you go, you want to clean that up the best you can before you put it on, do you? You need to go a little for that. Yes. No, so we got... Down in the door, wasn't it? Didn't look for Maybe. Maybe. You run your thing down inside the there, see your little magnet, see if you can find it. I'm going the other way. I wonder if there should be uh, rubbers behind that. I, on all other door handles, there generally is a rubber behind it. Uh, can I open the cup? Uh, yep. Yeah? Go for it. Because uh, there was uh, the rubber kit was in the trunk. Okay. Right by. Okay. So, so if there's any rubbers, that's, that's where they'd be.
look like crepe rubbers. Yeah. They're telling you not to take the door handles off. I'm not sure. Is that a bird's nest? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I suppose it is. My nest, you must have, have a squirrel's nest or something. Do you want that? No, I sure <laughs> don't. <laughs> Well, if you want to, would you rather be in your own presence or your own place to put them in? I, I think I would. Okay. Just, um, I understand completely. I think probably what I'll do is, is make, make uh, a rubber that goes around that. Otherwise, it's going to chip the paint. It, is, it very much well is so. As soon as it goes in there and chips the paint, yeah. um, you're, you're right. As soon as it knocks the paint off the side of that, well, then it's bare metal. I'll go in the parts book and see if, the, if they had it in, in the first place. But if they didn't, I'll, I'll, even black tape on, on, on there and then trimmed off. Would be better than nothing. Exactly. I had some auto saw ready to clean the, the handles for them. Yeah, no, I'll, 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 I'll do all that. that that's, that's just great. Okay, well, we'll just, we'll, we'll get it cleaned up. Or, no, I'm not going to do anything to it, actually. Probably do that right there. And then that be it. Yeah. And then we'll get John to come help us pick it up and send her home to you. Sounds good to me. Okay. I'm, I'm just as happy not doing anything to it. <laughs> no. Yeah. I'm, I'm happy with what we've done. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll, 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 I'll take my time. And yeah. I'll try, but if, I understand. If you try and rush a thing like that, you're, you're just have to screw something. I understand. Up. Believe me. Makes my job a little bit easier, doesn't it? Good. Yeah. I'll shut that door for you, Doug. Want the door shut? I'm just going to take that tape off here. Okay. Okay. I'm going to take all this stuff to your rubber strip. Leave all that there, leave that there, we'll, we'll deal with it. Yeah. We'll deal with it. Which you can if you like. Oh. But we can deal with it. We'll tape and get the rubber taped off. Okay. We can deal with it. Just leave it up. Do whatever you like. It's your car. I can take it off. Yeah, we'll take it off. Yeah. We'll take it off. Just leave it on. I'm going to take it off right now. Oh, are you? Julian's going to take it off. Good, babe. Yeah. Julian will get it. Oh, 
Meister. Can you get down to the side? Is that right here so you don't know? I don't know for sure, no. Where's your keys? Well, I gotta put a twos in first of all or figure out what, uh, what, uh, what happened. What, yeah. <laughs> you know. Yeah. <laughs> Just figure out what happened. Yeah. Um, so, so we're back to what? Do you wanna, do you wanna get a run in or what? We're scared to touch it first thing this morning. <laughs> we're scared to touch it. Uh, what do you want? Do you want to try to get a run in or anything, or do you want to wait for all till tomorrow? I wouldn't mind getting a run in. Well, let's let's pull the hood on her then. Let's get her out and go for it. We'll just leave the tape underneath the hood there. Mm -hmm. Just leave that, and let's let's try to get a run in. You want to do that? Well, let me check the, the fuses first. Okay. And see, see if that, that is the problem. All right, you check the fuse, and then we'll go from there. But I'll help you do anything you want to it. Like really, like if you. If you want to, like I can help start putting it back together if you like. Why don't you she'll come around and you start putting it back together, bud? Sad part is sometimes you really have to put it back in order. If you don't, you're in trouble. It look nice with the tail. I like the tail lights. Maybe I shouldn't get them out of the box here, but. Oh, nice. Yeah. Have to clean them up, put them on. Probably get a new rubber to go with them. All the Jaguar symbols have to go on. There's a squirrel in there. <laughs> A squirrel. I wonder if that's a squirrel that we get over in the trees over there. I see a few nuts over there. In the, you see that? Mm -hmm. I can put them in there. She looks snapping. Oh, wow, look at that oiler now. Would you? No. <laughs> He'll like that. Wow. That's from oil and from long distance, isn't it? That's for oiling a, a train. A train? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like I say, long, long, long distance. <laughs> yeah. 
even got a pumper on her too, eh? Well, the blade had uh, quite a collection of uh, antique trains, you know, the, the little model trains. Okay. Good, good collection. And uh, that was on the shelf there, so. Oh, John, like that. Yeah. <clears throat> we didn't take her easy this morning. Huh? Didn't take her easy this morning. Well, we take it right out of the, uh, down to the, um, tall golf caps and... We can. Have Let's have an easy day. He's talking <laughs> my kind of licorice now. <laughs> yeah, we can do that. Do you think you found the fuse at blue or? I don't know yet. Uh, I think it should be number three, but uh, does this car have a com this car doesn't have a computer? Does no, it? No, no. Has it? No. So I, I was I welded on the, the fender there. No. And uh, I know you're all blue. <laughs> Well, I walked on that fender there, and someone said, like, did you undo the battery? Well, there's no computer in that car to blow. No. That's what I was thinking, like, no. you know what I'm saying? Like, when newer cars, you have to unhook the battery, because you can do something to the computer, can you not? You can. You can yeah. Buy them. Yeah. Very well. And, and I got multi them, like, that, that Infinity probably has 150 computers in it. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, I, well, I, I'll, I'll, I'll let's face it. I don't know much about the old Jaguar system, so I didn't know, and someone said that, but. Na 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 na. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> kind of scared me for a second, you know what I mean? Well, on somebody's car, when you should be unhooking the battery. When you're doing the wrong thing on somebody's car and you don't know, it's, a, it's not a good moment because <clears throat> that is your mistake that you really have to fix. And uh, I generally try not to do that, and I'll tell you the reason why. Because you go behind so fast. And once you go behind, it's hard to get aboard again. It really is. There, I'm sitting this up. We have a little starting issue. I think we might have ran out of gas. Maybe. Did you run out of gas no, here today? No, day? no, no. I, I, I think probably what happened was it, it, it has a, uh, an electronic um, uh, enrichment uh, device. Yes. It pumps raw gas in. Yeah. Uh, for, in, in, until this little sensor senses that it's heated up, yeah. uh, and if if, uh, if if you do that a couple of times and, and don't let that clear, uh, you can plug the engine. Okay. And then it's a hell of a job trying to try to clear it. And that's that's what we were trying to do uh, before. Uh, and then Jeff shorted that thing out to to, to disconnect it. Yes. And and uh, instead of pulling it off, he shorted it to the body and click. Uh, Blue, blue something. So it's either it's either a fuse or a uh, um, relay. Yeah. Uh, and then if it's not the fuse, then I got to go to Peter and find out what relay it is. <laughs> Back to the expert. <laughs> that that's just information. He won't charge for information, will he? No, no, no. No. <laughs> if he did, it would be well worth it. Well, there you go. Yeah, it's nice to have Doug happy this morning working on his car. It's nice to have him happy working on his car. He's going to take her home and be happy with it. Now we can move on to the next little, um, I don't know what you call it, a repay of favors. That's what it is, a repay of favors. We're going to move on to the next one. Uh, Jolene's got her urn for her car. I might pull your car back. I might pull your car back there and look at the wheels on it mm -hmm. and, and try to get them arms put on before and then I can shove it back up in there and be done with it, you know what I mean? Once I get the arms put on Jolene's car, then I know the body can come off. But until I do that, it can't come off. I want to line the wheels up with the wheel with the fenders, but
I was checking fuses right now. Quiet. <laughs> well, hey, baby. Good morning. Mm -hmm. I gotta thank you. Look at this stuff. <laughs> the stuff here will be the parts I got from Lindsay. <clears throat> Thought I'd bring them in earlier. What I'll do is I'll clean up a 305 to get up there, and uh, we'll paint one up orange and put the, valve, the Aldebrock covers on with the Aldebrock dome, and then we'll have an old time looking 305, 350, whatever we make our heart desire, whatever we want it to, make, to be, and that's what I'll do. I'll make it look like an old engine. Um, basically taking it pretty easy here this morning, aren't we, baby? Mm -hmm. It's good. Taking it easy. Taking it easy. Huh? Back in the duck. <clears throat> That's okay. The old fuse box is right there, eh? Well, it's quite a mess of wires you got going on right there. Mm hmm. He says. <laughs> How many fuses in there? Uh, there's uh, eight. Did you pull every, every one of them out and check them? No, no, only one. You're not going to do that? No way, eh? Did you try the key even yet? I did. No. Oh, your battery's not hooked up. That would stop it from turning over. It's not stopping the, uh, the power to it yet. It's bum, bum, bum. Not the easiest thing to do. That's like looking for a wire and a, a needle in a haystack, is it not? <laughs> Doug? Well, not quite. But not quite? Quite a mess of wires going on there. Not much burn. All right! That looks burnt, he says. That's it. Whoop whoop! Doug, you're the champ. <laughs> huh? You're the champ. I hope for him that. Did you tell me how many yet? <laughs> Throw in the 30 just in case. <laughs> <laughs> Spectacles, testicles, wallet, watch. 35 amp. 35 amp. Would have been nice if there were some spare ones in there, but I don't see any. I don't know. Do you have, you, have, you must have some, do you? I don't know. Well, I know there was a, there was a car that might have some. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you two, you do too. So if you need them, you know where they're at.
Good day. Isn't it? Good day. It's a good day in the neighborhood. Yeah, that's pretty close. Oh, I got to thank everybody for all the compliments. And Doug, Doug doesn't know it, but a lot of people commented your car, Doug. Uh -huh. They're throwing some good compliments about your car. And we have to thank them because they're being nice. Thank you very much. If we don't show appreciation, then you probably won't want to try to do it again. <laughs> so we, we thank you. And I'm sure Doug would appreciate it too. Now it's just time to put her back together and uh, get her outside and take her for a run. Everybody has to, has to get her going first though, hey? Okay? That's the part of old cars, man. If you're getting into old cars, that's something that you really have to embrace is, I don't know, fixing and playing and that sort of stuff. It's almost like an old snowmobile. You go for a drive, then you fix it. <laughs> <laughs> you remember having a snowmobile like that, Doug? Uh, I, I had one on the farm. That's the only snowmobile I ever owned. Did you, did you run it and then fix it? Uh, no, I, I, I ran it. And... Kept it running? Yeah, uh, it, it, it was pretty reliable, actually. Oh, well. The ones I always had were, were not. And it could be because of myself, but um, they were not that reliable. Share, like, comment. Hit my bell, ring my bell. Shouldn't say that too loud. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It was fun to paint a car. I was telling Doug that I was nervous when I painted it, and I was. It's been a while since I painted. Never show it. Yeah. yeah. True professional. True professional, he called me. He just made me blush. <laughs> I, ho I hope that works for you, Doug. I hope so, too. <laughs> if not, we're going to tear the motor out of her? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no, we're not going to tear the motor out of her? We have to take the head off? No. No. None of the above. I'll get the oil galleries. <laughs> there, a little bit of luck, that's going to work. Now, do you have to open the hood? To help I, the battery up, or? I do, yeah. Okay. Is that a bad thing? Nope, just, I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna untape it, that's all. Yeah. yeah. No, that's released, isn't it? Is it not? That don't go up, did it? What if I push down, push down on that? No, no, I, I wouldn't push on it. That one's released. Yeah. Maybe just stop. Can you screw drive and pry that up? <laughs> yeah. I don't think so. <laughs> Come on, baby. There we go. Hickory dickory dock. Yeah, there's a clip underneath there, you know that, right? Yeah. Got See, there's a, there a felt thing there. Yeah. It blew off. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I'm not going to touch it. You want me to hook it back up? I did. Oh. I'll leave it alone. You yeah, don't yeah. let you do that. Yeah. Let Doug do that. Mm -hmm. I, I can tell you one thing. I like the color of the wood with mm -hmm. the black Me too. and with the and with the, with the red interior. I think it's gonna be smoking. She, she got a clock. Yeah. The original one uh, wasn't worth a picture of shit. It had plastic gears in it. There you go. I, I, so that's true when I say that plastic gears next year. Yeah, so I, I went to uh, Value Village. Yeah. And there was a weak weak lock there, and I took the center part out and and, and ground the the uh, the thing that was 
the, the, the side in. Yeah. To, to fit in behind. And Jeff made me up this little uh, piece of wood piece in here. Wow. And, and it's, uh, it works like a charm. Well, there you go. You put a, put a battery in it and bang, there you are. <laughs> Doug got himself a new clock in his car. That yeah. was a big thing back in the day, wasn't it? It cost me $2. <laughs> there you go. You're, that's my kind of flavor right there, $2. Yeah. Uh, you had the keys, uh, didn't you? I just oh, gave, you had, I give them to, now they're right here. We put the back up there. You want me to hook that, that ground up? Uh, you have, do you have a wrench for that? Well, I can pick it up and put it on. I just don't want to cross it. I'm hitting nothing and... No, 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 you're not going to... Well, see, that's where I just back up because I don't want to pay for something that is not mine. That's where I learned that stuff. I would not charge you. <laughs> well, I just double make sure and stay away from it. <laughs> right? That's how I do it, Doug. You know, I fight, but listen, I've messed up some stuff in my life. Oh, and, uh, I, once you mess it up, you, you generally you're on the hook. Yeah, yeah. Generally, you're on the hook. And uh, for any young person out there that doesn't know that, if you break something, that's you know that's how you go behind, right? So I, I try not to, yeah, get backed up and do the wrong thing. I sometimes take it a bit far, but that way there I'm safe. You know what I'm saying? Now old school is your fiction. <laughs> oh, that's all. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like I'm old school. I fiction. Well, I didn't do that. Yeah, well, it was like that. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Yeah, that's for somebody else. Nope. I hope we have power. I hope we do too. Got lights on. Oh, got lights on in there. Did you have lights on in there before? No. Uh, not, not when we, uh, only when the door's open. We got lights on the dash there. The door's open. I'll get, you'll get a big old hell yeah out of me if she turns over. Not sure. Well, I hope so. For both of our sakes. That's the fuel pump. Did you do that before? When you did that before? I heard something click up here too. Yeah! Hell yeah! Hey! Good job! Good job, Doug! Just like that. Just like that. Just like that. Just had to do a little investigation, that's all. It's good. And that's the way it normally starts. It's, it's been very reliable that car. Hmm. Since, since Peter's done his thing. Awesome. Yeah. Since Peter done his thing, eh? Do you want me to take any of that stuff from you? Yeah, sure. There you go. Peter Osborne is the, uh, is the guru. When you, when, you, when you have a problem with one of these and you don't know how to solve it, go see Peter. <laughs> We always say, Bob's your uncle and Peter's your regular. Right? Jolene used to be a bartender and there was always a Peter, was there not? There, at least we know we can drive it on the trailer. And That's good. Away we go. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Makes me happy. Yeah. Yeah. Really happy. Things are going good. Things are going good. Just don't let Jeff touch. <laughs> She's looking good, baby. She's right. Nice. Her hair looking good. Mm -hmm. That's good. There we go. You got her running again, and wow, awesome. Life is good. Life is good again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So that's good. So I, I'm going to take the day off. Yeah, I'm going to so take. The, I'm going to take the day off. So we can find some hubcaps. For find my, some hub for, for my Hudson. Then we'll go find some hubcaps for Doug's Hudson. Or, I'm happy. Have Doug's have happy. Have a nice lunch. Yeah. Oh, life is good. Yeah. I've got his car running again. That's good. You'll be able to drive it on the trailer. If you have no problems there, yeah. you'll go home happy and sleep good tonight. You won't have to think what's wrong with that car. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder how many nights you lost sleep you lost over that. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I wonder if I couldn't sort it up Peter would. Okay. <laughs> That's good. You have resources. You've got all your pieces. Yeah. yeah. If anybody's got a Jaguar and they got a problem with them, they can't figure it out, see Peter Osborne. Peter Osborne. Green Motors. He's yeah. the, He's the guru. Resident guru.
Okay. Yeah. If it builds, you'll want to know. I'm hoping we don't have to go see him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I like him at all. I just hope we don't have to go visit him. Nice to yeah. know he's there and he's, he's, he's done it. He's, oh, yeah. he's kept me on the road with my car. Yeah. Well, here we go. We're going in. Yeah. We're getting in. We're getting involved somehow. That that engine, I completely rebuild. Yeah. Put it in, and then I I, I, uh, I, I wanted to take it to Peter's to, to be commissioned before yeah. before you start running it. Yeah. So so I take it in there. Uh, I had one fuel pump hooked in backwards. He fixed that. Uh, started up and ran like a top, quiet as could be for about a minute and a half. He looked in the uh, in where, where the oil was. The the the, the, uh, uh, the oil was mixed mixed with antifreeze. Uh -huh. Oh shit! So he turns it off. Mm -hmm. So then what what the problem is? So he figured we better pull ahead. Maybe the the head gasket wasn't done properly. Takes it off, head gasket's perfect. Yeah, no problem there. So now, now to get um, uh, where it could possibly be would, would be the cover for the uh, for the timing chain. Yeah. Uh, to, in order to get at that, you got to haul the radiator out. Take the front end off. Well, I had to haul the radiator out to get clearance to get the to get, to get it out. To get that all apart. There, there's a friggin' gasket in there. That's a real fine gasket. Then they produced two of them. One had a, a, a blockage yeah. going across the little square part uh, to, to cut off the oil mixing with the water. The other didn't. So I put it on, didn't, didn't notice that uh, I, thought, how did it I, I thought it had the right gasket. I mean, you, you got a gasket set for the how, engine. How do you work on Do you have to take the hood off them cars? Like it's quite uh, something the, in it. The engine? Well, like, I mean, the, the hood comes up like this. How do you get it in front of the engine with it like that? It's just a... Uh, well, you, you can take the hood off. Don't okay. have that trouble. Okay. But here, for the sake of a friggin' gasket, I was into uh, almost five thousand bucks. Wow. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. For for one friggin' paper gasket. Uh, I'm glad that that wasn't um, my bill. Yeah. Well, <laughs> at least you solved the problem. Yeah. Yeah. Not, not a good life at all. Wow. Well, there you go. That, that's just how, how, how messed up you can get for, for, for simple things that you don't expect. I mean, you get a gasket set, you put it on, you figure all is well. And uh, you had the wrong gasket. One, one gasket, everything else was fine. This one yeah. friggin' gasket uh, was the wrong one, and, and I didn't notice. And she was just mixing. It was mixing. It was, uh, you know, the, the, the water was, the antifreeze was pumping directly into the crankcase. Wow. No, you, you no, why, it, why would you make something that stupid? <laughs> <laughs> why, why would you have two different you know, you two know why different is, for, for, for the same engine? You know what why is? The letter that can't be straightened in the alphabet. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I swear they set up at night. The engineers sat, sat up at night and figured out, how are we going to screw them today? You know, we're, we're, we're just going to drive them out of their minds. <laughs> and they do. <laughs> well, the, the uh, one, the one that really, I'm halfway there, so. The one that really signified that to me I had uh, I, I had an 83 and and the, uh, the there's a light in the back of the door you know trouble when, when the doors open yeah. to, to warn people they wouldn't blow on this door so so I went to the switch in the door took the switch right out and figured that'd do it. no sir light's still on so finally I went to Peter the the, the light in this door on the right hand door back feeds all of them. Th through, through, to this door, through a diode in the back of the glove box. Now, who in the hell would ever figure that out other than Peter? <laughs> well, it is the way they do it, I guess. Yeah. I tell you. And there's no reason for it. Absolutely. There's no reason for it. Absolutely no, no, no logical reason. That for person's it. been fired. No, no, they, they probably got a promotion for, <laughs> for, for up the text. And there you go. Yeah. yeah. Making things difficult. Yeah. That's funny. Looks good. Mm -hmm. Looks gorgeous. Yeah, not good. Gorgeous. <laughs> Did you see this thing we got yesterday? Derek would bring this thing in. It's a, it's a, it's a pump for a car. You mount it on a, you mount on a car. Yes. You get an air hose here, and and you can pump up your tires. Oh, yeah. you mount on a car. So if Jolene has air riding her car, this pump will come out. Are, are, are you sure that's for Eric? Well, right there, look. I know that I'm getting air out of it, but uh, I, I told it was an air pump for a car. It was mounted to a car for an air pump. Pump up your tires. Okay. So if your tires are down, you take your hose, put on your tires. Yeah. And... I, I, I would have thought it was a like an automatic greaser for, for the old cars. Some some of the old cars 
had a, had an automatic greaser. Okay. Where, where you could pump out a couple of times. Oh, I don't know where go, you go through the tubes. Uh, hmm. Is that air? It looks like an air chuck on it. It does look like air. Yeah. 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 yeah you're probably right. <laughs> so we, if we were going to put air in Joanne's car seat, we just put the old, put the old thing there and pump her up. <laughs> Talk to you later, Joanne. <laughs> yeah. Joanne's getting closer. <laughs> yeah. That came in yesterday, from Derek Wood. Pardon? That came in yesterday, Derek Wood gave it to us. Well, that's also, that's give us. A, that's, that's early neat. Yeah. That's just, give Joanne a little car. Neat. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. I'm going to take you to Derek Woods. Yeah. We'll, we'll check out some of his cars. You'll like his cars. Yeah. He got some English stuff there. Mm-hmm. He's quite a good dude. Wood guy. Yeah. Builds cabinets. Yes. Yeah. All righty. We might as well end this one. Mm-hmm. We're going to end this one. Doug's happy. I'm happy. Yeah. Over the moon. Okay. Have a good one. Thanks for all the comments. Like, share, ring our bell. See you all later. <laughs>